Hello everybody, Azumi here, and today we're going to do a welcome, and I am not familiar with that word, we're just going to say pastry. So, welcome pastry thrill 8 star. Alright, so first up in my team is Vilzius. And second is going to be Apocalyptic Kawaru, because, you know, why not? And right in the middle is Infected Sith. Alright, and fourth is uh, Narbaro Gamma. Uh, you know, I am the worst pronunciation person in the world. And last is Sorticia. Alright, let's go. Alright, so we have Confectioner Letitia. Her action skill does um, HP recovery to all of her allies as well as a dark attack damage to your front row and slow for three turns to Aesir, Elf, and Yotun. Her auto skill does dark attack damage and shadow bound for three turns to Aesir, Elf, and Yotun as well as high chaos field and gravity field. Alright, let's move on to the light crystals. The magic crystals in the very back row are the light crystals. They do um, defense and magic defense 20% up for two turns to all of its allies as well as two enemies with the lowest light resistance get hit with light magic attack and three also three enemies with the lowest light resistance get hit with light magic attack all right next we're gonna go to the dark crystals which are the melee ones and the, they do these are the ones that you're gonna want to get rid of because it makes it a pain so the auto skill does all allies 30% attack shield for two turns. So that's going to mean that magic attack is going to be way more effective in this fight than attack as long as these crystals are there. As well as all enemies it hits with dark attack damage and magic attack 20% down for two turns. Alright, so really, I could probably multi-solo this easily, but I'm using Filzius for the boosted drops, and he doesn't really synergize too well with the rest of my team. So, I think if I took him out and maybe used um, Eve Raspy or something like that, I probably would be able to multi-solo. Also, the teapot weapon from this is fairly good. Uh, because it has Frenzy for two turns as well as Dark Element up for two turns. So keep that in mind and make a few of those. Alright, we're going to go look at the damage here. And there you go. Have a nice